from past relationships, um, I think we learned that uh, it's a very important to try to um, be understanding to each other and not to forget that it's not only uh, you or not only um, like she or he, it's us, it's a it's, um, team, it's a couple and uh, Sometimes, unfortunately, but again, it's it's everything is came with experience, with years, with experience. Uh, uh, I think the more younger we are, the more we maybe more selfish. Of course, it's also depending on which family you was grown up. But sometimes, um, many of us, unfortunately, was also grown up in families where parents um, broke up, so we don't really know. We don't even really know this model of of relationships between women and men, how to build it how it's uh, important uh, well, let's say even such a little example uh, you go eat uh, in the morning let's say and it's how it's nice when all family go together eat and uh, not like one person then another person then just when you do things together or maybe you go to the store or you cook to, to um, again it's my view maybe somebody disagree with me but this is something which is important for me and I also I learned this from le relations from the past that it's important to try to find out what is really important to your partner, how he or she feel um, certain moments, certain day. Maybe your partner just started from the work and don't have energy, but it's not because he's angry on you, uh, because you you kind of can think that he's in a bad mood. Maybe it's just some stress with business or some stress with work or maybe some something with colleagues, who knows. It's very important to to be open, to have a good conversation, to be understanding and to feel your partner, uh, to know where, where maybe sometimes it's better to speak, sometimes better not to speak. So these this detail, details I, I learned from the past. Like I said, communication is the mostly important. Many times people just, because of this miscommunication, somebody think one thing, another thinks something different, and people just broke up because they, was, they just didn't understand each other. They, not like I said, let's uh, give example, a woman, she looked not happy, and men think, oh my God, what did I done that she's so not happy? But maybe she just wear some, I don't know, wrong shoes, and she, she just tired of, of walking in these high heels and she look not happy, she look upset. But men can take it towards him that she not happy with him. But in reality, it's such a different thing and people just need to communicate to understand each other. So communication is the most important. And I think uh, we can avoid a lot of, a lot of maybe problems or conflicts when we um, uh, communicate uh, with each other and uh, try, to, try to, to be understanding to each other.